Hello, in this video, I will show you how to create a trainer. So, this is the Crack Me 9. So that at the moment, if you enter 2 and check, you get this. So, we're gonna create a trainer that will patch this software so that no matter whatever soft, whatever number you enter, it will always be correct. So, load, let's load the. So, what I need here is. Uh, my dog icon for the trainer and then my dog image dog image is for the picture that is going to be shown inside the trainer and also my cheat table so let us load the cheat table first load the cheat table so my cheat table is here So this is a cheat table which uh, we discussed in some previous videos. So what this cheat table does is just to patch this uh, software to make it uh, always uh, written correct for whatever key you enter. First thing we need to do is to right click and set the hotkeys. <coughs> so just cl click on create hotkey. And then you can able you're able to set alternate one or whatever key you want. And then here you select the sound and give some description and click apply. Click OK. Do the same thing for alternate two. So uh, alternate two is to disable deactivate the script. Then click OK. Select the sound. Click OK. Next thing is you go to file. Click on generate generic trainer Lua script from table and continue so now here select the process name so we load the process first attach it to the attach to crack me 9 and then here go and select the process from here Crack me nine. This one. And then over here give a name for this. Crack me nine trainer. And you can see about text made by whoever you want to name. <coughs> and then here uncheck this <coughs> set icon. Choose the dog icon. Set side image. Choose the doggy image. And then over here, place sound on activate and deactivate. And now over here, design user interface manually. So click on this, and you will get the form designer. This is the form designer. So over here, make sure you expand the size because the default is too small. Make it bigger. Move this down. So once you're happy with the design, just save this design. File, save. Save your form design somewhere and just give a name, crack me 9. So that in future you can reopen this form and edit it. Okay, now you are ready to build. So go here and click generate trainer. And now you select uh, the location where you want to save it and give it a name. It will be an exe file. Click save. Here, change icon and select the dog icon. Okay, so there you have it. Here, change the process to 32-bit. If your crack me is 32-bit. Here, make sure it's gigantic. And if you put tiny, then the user will need to install cheat engine. If, if your user doesn't have a cheat engine, 
then select gigantic then click generate just wait for it to generate it has been successfully generated now you can close and then you can save again one more time make sure it's safe grab me 9 form and now you can close everything now you can go to your you can close the uh, cheat engine totally and there is your trainer crack me 9 trainer okay so make sure you open your crack me first then followed by the trainer so that the trainer will be able to attach to it and over here now alternate one to attach to activate the script now if you click before attaching the activating the script when you click on check it gives you wrong zero key but now you alternate one so it gets information okay and now you click check correct key if you alternate two now to deactivate the script and now you click check sorry wrong key if you click about it says trainer was made by who and you can close it notice here the side image is missing so to fix that we can reopen the form using cheat engine go back to cheat engine <coughs> reload the cheat table <coughs> <coughs> and then over here now <coughs> you can go to table <coughs> and here you can uh, uh, see trainer <coughs> click on create form and then here close this form load the one that you want which is this alright so this is the form you want to edit so click on this and specify an image for it so at the moment there is no image so this is the image uh, property go down and look for image the picture and then load the doggy this doggy click open click ok now if you look at this you should have a doggy image there alright and then now you're ready to save click file save save this overwrite the existing form and then now you can generate your <coughs> your trainer this is trainer one the second one restore and show okay so let's try to click on edit now now it's okay save again I'm sorry, if you wanted to make changes to your existing trainer, you reopen your cheat engine and then you load the cheat table click no then over here, you need to start the table designer so let's see over here you have a CD trainer already so you can say edit and down here load the form okay now you can make changes you can change this icon uh, this image click on this and over here is your 
or image property you can go here and select the picture that you want click load select the picture click OK so once you've got that uh, you can generate uh, your new click file save first save now you can generate so you can go here and click file generate configuring erase yes okay so over here you have to go through the same process again select the crack me 9 process name um, go give a name for or you can do another way is design user interface generally generically okay and over here you load your new form which you have created this one yes so now you've done that uh, you can give a name make sure your icon is set dog and your site image is also set check on this and process name is correct okay click generate trainer and give a name for your trainer click save replace it change the icon, change the target 32 bit change the exe change the icon doggy and click generate that's it so now you can close everything and your trainer is there your updated one so make sure your grab is started first and then click on your trainer okay so now to activate it now it's not activated alternate one and then here it's working alternate two disable and now we disable it okay so that's how you create a trainer for your crack me and remember our crack me is a lua script so if you remember previously what we did was we use lua script to write the cheat table let me show you again see we are using lua script throughout no assembly and all so lua script is also can use in uh, creating cheat uh, cheat engine trainer that's all so thank you if you like this video please remember to like subscribe and share thank you for watching i will see you in the next uh, videos